What's going on, guys? It's your boy Agen Bagen for another Alchemy Stars video. And for today, it's time for some Alchemy Stars news and updates since we are nearing the real 2.5 year anniversary of Alchemy Stars. So let us go ahead and check out the official uh, subreddit of Alchemy Stars. So we have here uh, the limited time event called Shadows Beneath the Gloom. Uh, this one will start from December 20 up to January 10. And this one, the, the poster for this one looks really, really good. I don't know, I don't remember this uh, waifu here. I think she's going to be the B lane in this upcoming uh, event. Is Ban is going to have an alternate character. And finally, Shawl has been released from the NPC jail. Yes, and we will talk about uh, Shawl later. So, this event is going to be another story event tied to the Umbraton event because East Ban is from uh, Umbraton, right? Uh, we have three upcoming characters. We have your East Ban Alter, uh, East Ban Scarred Pit. So, SP, East Ban SP. We'll just call him uh, East Ban SP. Uh, I'm just uh, worried that East Ban is going to be a 5 star because of the pattern. New pattern releases by the new developers of the Alchemy Stars. Usually, they release the 6 star now. The first character to beat this is going to be the 6 star. The second one is another 6 star. And the last one is going to be the Welper character. And this time, we will be getting two new 6 star characters and one 5 star character, which is going to be a Welper character. And I'm scared that Isbal is going to be a welfare character because he was this the last. So meaning there is a uh, high chance that Isban Alter is going to be the welfare character, the pre-5 star. And I'm not really a fan of welfare characters because most of them are meh. Unless they are uh, tile converters, if they are a DPS character, they are just meh. The design of Isban looks really really good. With some Wolverine Claws here. Uh, I really like the Wolverine Claws here. Really, really nice. And then, the abs. I'm not I'm not a Hasbando lover. So, Hasbando lovers are eating good this upcoming 2.5 year anniversary. And then, we have here the Ascension uh, A3 Art of Isban. Yes, Wolverine style. Uh, he is Wolverine with some uh, really nice uh, Anacondas here. And some chess pieces. Why there are chess pieces? I don't know why there are chess pieces. Uh, oh, maybe the he is ban is fighting the chess pieces gang because we have some uh, monsters chess pieces, right? The king, the queen, pawn, rook, bishop, and the knight. Really, really gorgeous art. But as I've said earlier, I'm kinda afraid that he's going to be the welfare character. If he's going to be the welfare character, at least make him uh, somewhat have some some form of utility. But if he's going to be a DPS character, then it's such a shame. Such a shame for a design. Uh, the second character to beat this is this guy called Virgil. Yes, we have two new male characters in, the, in this upcoming 2.5 year anniversary, which is a re really, really nice balance of female to male ratio in this game uh, but Virgil might be the other 6 star character yes so truth connoisseur Virgil uh, Virgil is, is also from Umbraton uh, he has some thick thighs and thick legs here uh, this is her this is his uh, ascension uh, art I'm not really sure what to expect about Virgil, but I hope that he is going to be the welfare character, not Isban Alter, because Isban Alter's design is way, way gorgeous compared to Virgil. But we will see uh, when the 2.5 year anniversary comes, or maybe later, because maybe later we will be getting the, what do you call this, the skill kit reveal for these upcoming characters uh, lastly we have a new character which is uh, 
finally out of the NPC jail, which is Shiol. Uh, she is voiced by Mamiko Noto. I'm familiar. The voice actress is kind of familiar, but I think this one is already available in the game. Shiol is finally getting the love. Because uh, I think Shoal is going to be the exclusive character. Judging by the comments also in the subreddit, uh, they are saying that Shoal is going to be the exclusive character in this upcoming 2.5 year anniversary of Alchemy Stars. Well, she deserves that one. She looks gorgeous. Look at this uh, Ascension Tree art. Wait, wait, where is it? Ah, this one. Look at her. Gorgeous. Mamma Mia. And there is some uh, form of Yu-Gi-Oh! reference here because Shoal is holding the Millennium Puzzle. Yes, if you're not familiar with Yu-Gi-Oh! This one looks just like the Millennium Puzzle that is uh, hanging around Yu-Gi's neck. Yeah, Shoal has thick ties, yes. And as a Lex enjoyer, this is really, really good for me. I hope that Shoal's kit will be OP, really, really nice. And besides these upcoming three characters, we will be getting skins. We will also be getting some skins. Uh, this one, Patty and Patsy from the Battle Pass. This is going to be the pre skin. Uh, I'm not a fan of this design. It is what it is. Pre is pre. Uh, the next one is Lee Chan Chan, uh, the five star character from the Battle Pass. Uh, as Bando lovers are taking a big dubs this upcoming 2.5 year anniversary because probably it's the time for Dust Band the lovers to enjoy themselves in playing Alchemy Stars but I'm not gonna be buying this one uh, I'm still staying F2P for now and then lastly we will be getting a skin for the character that I don't have Lilika yes this one looks gorgeous and uh, I think they they showed some skin for Lilika here Look at the breast. Is this Lilika's uh, really breast size? I'm not sure. I don't have her. I wish I have her uh, to pair with my uh, shield characters in the fire, uh, fire element. But yeah, this is going to be the Christmas skin for uh, Lilika. Maybe there will be some upcoming skins more after this one. Maybe another skin gacha. <laughs> Who knows? But. Alchemy Stars is uh, releasing uh, skin gachas, right? So maybe there will be some uh, form of Christmas skin gacha. So yeah, those are the upcoming things in this uh, 2.5 year anniversary to look forward to. I'm really excited for Shoal and also Isban Alter. Uh, what do you guys think about this upcoming event? Is it good or not? Let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below. And I think that's it for me for today, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please leave a like and subscribe. I would really appreciate it if you could help me grow my channel more. And thank you to everyone who are supporting my channel. I appreciate every one of you. Until next time, peace.